everybody, how's it going? It's a Daily Shooter, and today I've got a review of a GoPro mount for your hat that I got from BrainExplorerCreations.com. This is a really good first-person camera mounting solution. You know, a lot of the problems that I have, or at least the most time-consuming problem that I have when I go out and I do a review, is setting up different camera angles. Whether I want to view the target or the item that I might be reviewing, I have to set up multiple cameras at different angles, and it really just takes a lot of time to constantly move that. Well, first-person is kind of a good solution. It shows you maybe the optic or the pistol. Uh, as well as the target and kind of what I'm doing behind the scenes. So I really like that. The problem that I have with some of the GoPro mounts that are out there for your head are they don't hold securely, they bounce a lot, they react to recoil. This particular mount doesn't do that at all. It's completely secure and I absolutely love it. So let's go ahead and check it out. Okay, so here's a look at the mount without the GoPro or the hat attached to it. This is a very lightweight construction. It is a polymer design, and uh, you really can't feel it when it's on your hat until you actually add the GoPro to it, obviously. Uh, they do sell these for the Session. I have the Hero 4 Silver, and that's what I'm going to be using here. But they do sell these for the Session as well, so that's something to keep in mind if you want something a little bit more lightweight. Here's what it looks like at the bottom. Basically, it has a long clip that runs along the top of your brim, and then it clips onto the front of the brim. And on the back, you can see that it does have some hook and loop. This hook and loop basically works with any type of patch hat. You don't have to use it with a patch hat, but if you want the most secure mounting solution then a morale patch hat or something like that that you can velcro this thing onto is probably the best way to do it so you can see right there that it fits the contour of your head and then attaches really nice to the velcro that's how i'm able to get it without bouncing around or, or kind of get the tightest fit possible now installing the gopro on this thing is pretty easy too and that's because it uses the standard gopro case all you have to do is remove the mounting screw, remove whatever back that you might be using, and press the mounting section into the actual hat mount itself. That kind of creates a little bit of a clamshell, just like it does on the normal back doors for your GoPro. Once you have that pushed all the way into the bottom there, and you can see that you're pretty much lined up with the mount itself, all you have to do is close it onto the mount and use the standard bracket that came with your GoPro originally. So you don't have to worry about buying any extra equipment. You just buy this mount and it clips on there really nice and tight. So installation of your GoPro is easy, really nice, tight, secure. You're not gonna have to worry about this thing flying anywhere and basically ruining your camera. Now, not only is this a good first-person mount, but this is also a great hands-free solution. So if you want to be able to film something that you're doing, you don't want to do it from behind a tripod or have some type of weird camera angle, you can use your GoPro to do it, attach it to this and your hat, and you can have a great mounting solution that allow you to use both hands. So having that is definitely a major bonus. You can load your magazines like I'm doing here. You can do different tasks that require you to still have something on camera, but at the same time, give that perspective that the audience is really going to like. So here you can actually see me shooting at the target. You can hear the sounds, the pings of the steel, and kind of get that instant reaction of this is what it looks like from my perspective. So again, hands-free, good first-person shooting perspective, and I think a, a lot more entertaining if you're watching it from this perspective other than just a tripod. Now it's not gonna show one particular thing like maybe a comp or something like that, but still, this perspective is very cool. This is a great mounting solution. Again, check out brainexplodercreations.com for this mount. Thank you all very much for watching. Please like, subscribe, and have a great day.